Steel is an essential metal in the oil and gas industry. It is used widely across all stages in the industry, from production processing to the distribution of refined products. As the industry deals with the several highly combustible products, no industry is prone to fire-related accidents than the oil and gas. In the case of fire incident in a steel-made industry, the temperature can be as high as over 1100 degrees Celsius. When the temperature gets to 550 degrees Celsius, about half of the original strength of steel is lost. It is at this critical temperature that a load-bearing steel starts to collapse. The purpose of passive fireproofing in the industry is to retain steel integrity intact for a certain period of time and to prevent steel from collapsing prematurely. A fireproofed steel can withstand the fire up to 240 minutes. Various fireproofing products can be used in making steel fireproof. Intumescent fireproofing, often referred to as intumescent coating, is based on epoxy. The coating swells up to five times to its original thickness to form an insulating char, and the char protects the steel from fire. In the case of cementitious fireproofing, the base material is vermiculite. A cementitious fireproofing has a cooling effect. That is, it can keep moisture within itself, and later the moisture evaporates when the surrounding temperature is increased. After evaporating all the moisture as steam, the cementitious fireproofing uses its low thermal conductivity and high thermal resistance property to keep the fire away from the steel. The board or casting method of fire protection works in the same way as the cementitious fireproofing and are dry fixed around the steel. Fireproofing is a safety critical element and heavily regulated business today. An improperly applied or maintained fireproofing system can lead the system to failure in the fire outbreak and loss of human life and assets are the possible result. It is therefore recommended to educate your workforce to ensure that the application, inspection and quality control works of a fireproofing system at your facility is carried out according to the applicable standards and specification. Learn more about the fireproofing training courses offered by the Institute for Oil and Gas Sector. Visit our website at www.iogs.org or write to us at training at iogs.org for a customized training at your facility.